Um, yeah, we're live. Okay. Hello, everyone. My name is uh, Aikaba, and today's, uh, well, since we were doing episode one of What the Fox, uh, meet uh, Blood Wolf right here. Uh, Blood Wolf, do you guys, do you want to introduce yourself? Uh, yeah, give me one second. I'll take your time. Don't know what, what to say much, but I'm Blood Wolf. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're good. You're good. Um, yeah. Um, well, <laughs> that's okay. Uh, let's start on with the first uh question. What kind of games do you like to play? Uh, what kind of games do I like to play? Usually depends on my moods. Like I play mm. all kinds of games, but it goes from shooting games to Cute games where they just roam around, have fun, <laughs> and also VR chat, because I get to meet people like you, and all my friends. Just everything, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, no, that's understandable. I can relate to that. There you go. As long as I can play with friends. Yeah, just playing with friends and just giving them huggies feels nice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Huggy. Uh question two, is there things you like like and dislike in video games? Mm, I guess the only thing that I dislike about video games is jump scares. Because I really don't like jump scares. <laughs> oh, that's understandable. <laughs> I can understand that. That's not fun. Um, then a while for the liking part, it was all. It, it's also just I uh, like hanging around with people, just chilling, having fun. It's usually what matters to me if I can have fun with people. Yeah, because hanging out with friends that care about you and don't backstab you is one thing. That's what I will say. Mm. Anyways, uh. Exactly. I don't know what else to say on that one. It's adrenaline and whatever from going to the store earlier got my heart pumping. Uh, <laughs> anyways. Good ding, good ding, Question four. When did you join VRChat and did you have a good time making friends? I think I joined VRChat around 2017. I don't know exactly which month. People know I don't. <laughs> mm -hmm. And that's the first time I played it. I played it with a friend and I was just having fun being random, being a mute. And then I met some friends later when I went back home and then started playing it on my own and just got into a nice friend group where everyone just was having fun chilling, watching movies, met many great people, then met other friend groups. It's just been nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> I don't know what else to ask on that one. Now, number five. How did you meet Hero when you first m met him? How oh, I met Hero when I first met him? I think I met Hero through another friend. Because usually I would have a world up where everyone in the, the group, the friend group the, in the early days, always joined on one session and we all just hung out. And he just tagged along with a friend of mine. And then we just became friends. Yeah. And I'll say right now, it's just that easy. <laughs> I'll say right now, uh, <laughs> Hero's like a good friend and he does care for his friends. He, he's a good guy. Yeah. Same with his mom. I'll say that right now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he's a great guy. Yeah. He, he's fun to hang with, always cares about people, tries his best to help however he can. Yeah. I just wish people would stop uh, shit talking him because they don't know him. They really need to shut the fuck up. Anyways, um, oh, 
I, <laughs> this question got me giggling a little. Uh, the question six, what's the, the thing about cookie marshmallow? <laughs> the cookie marshmallow thing. <laughs> Uh, yeah, how should I put this in words? It started off of, as me being, uh, like, uh, in the friend group I had, I was the server owner in Discord. And I was just having fun doing random stuff. And I started making roles, and I was like, okay, people usually always, always have me with loving cookies. I don't know why. And then at some point there was also a marshmallow somewhere, I don't know where. But at some point I was making, I made a cookie roll, and I made a marshmallow roll. And then just at every point someone joined the server, I was always like, cookie or marshmallow. And then that would be the, be the if they picked cookie, I would give them that roll. If they gave marshmallow, I picked that roll. Just <laughs> for fun. <laughs> <laughs> that's, okay. that's basically it. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's cute. That's actually kind of adorable. That's a little cute origin story of that. <laughs> My heart's actually melting from that. Uh, number seven. Aww. Why do you always give huggies? Why I always give huggies? Well, for one, I like huggies. I like giving hugs. I like getting <laughs> hugs. <laughs> and for the second thing, it's... I, I just want people to feel welcome and loved Aww. and happy. <laughs> just want people to be happy, you know? Oh, no, that's and understandable. And can help with that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my heart. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Take your time. Oh, I am. It's just probably need to lay down after when I get the other thing done for tonight. Um... Mm. Hold on. Okay, here we go. Making sure if I'm counting right. Uh, what movies from the past and now are your are your favorites when you were growing up? Hmm. From the past movies, I always loved Disney movies. I used to have like CDs of multiple Disney movies on them and always would like, I want to watch Disney movies when I was a kid. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't matter which one, just picked one and just started watching them. And basically, I guess from movies nowadays, it also is just from Disney, I went to Ghibli because I just love Ghibli. <laughs> I love anime. I love the huge stuff. So that. <laughs> Just intertwined with each other. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um. I don't know what else to say because I've watched some Studio Ghibli uh, movies or some of what other mm -hmm. stuff they posted. And it's not bad. I like it. Kind of has really good storytelling. Don't know what else to uh, ass on it because my brain is kind of like because because he saw me. <laughs> You saw me from earlier today with, with uh, I was dealing with, I'm like, too much voices in my head. So, yeah. Jesus. Um, hold on, I'm trying to make sure I'm not Just repeating ones. Don't have to rush. Oh, I know. <laughs> Probably a little bit hyper. What cartoons did you watch growing up? That's number nine, uh, question nine. What co cartoons did I watch? Uh... I usually just watched what was on 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 the TV when I when I came home. And I just remember what kind of shows that I have. I had Rocket Power is one I uh, I remember. Uh, watch with Andy. Um, Friendly or Parents. And just just whatever was on. <laughs> Invader Zim. Oh, Invader uh, Zim was good. That was Chalk the Zone shit. Was one. <laughs> Wait, have you seen Danny Phantom? Actually, I have seen Danny Phantom. Yeah, he's a phantom. He's a phantom. Ooh. I... <laughs> <laughs> 
Yeah, that was <laughs> yeah. a fun show. <laughs> yeah, like the the ending of that show was so good. How they ended it, where all the villains helped uh, Danny uh, Phantom uh, stop the big bad from destroying their town and all that stuff. And then Danny revealed his uh, oh. identity to the town. And they were just like, "We knew all the time, so you're fine. You're not in trouble." <laughs> it's just like that character <laughs> development was just like, huh? It's just like it's yeah from. For me, it usually was also always a problem because I always watched it on TV and I didn't have anything else to watch it on. So it always was like just the random episode that was on and sometimes a marathon, but that's it. <laughs> yeah. So I never always had the full story, <laughs> sadly. And actually, my one big gripe with some like, because you know how like some cartoons uh, come back and they bring them back. I like mm-hmm. and don't like how they brought back Total Drama Island because like... They, oh, they brought yeah. it back, but not with the same characters, so we have, like, different ones. So I'm just like, I haven't mm-hmm. seen it, but I saw, like, uh, clips of it on TV or YouTube. I'm like, eh. But, like, when I have time, yeah. I might watch it to see if it's not bad from the predecessor. Because, <laughs> like, that... Yeah, remakes are a 50-50. Yeah. Could be good, could be bad. Eh. Like, hey, if they made a spinoff Kim Possible with Ron, I, I would watch it <laughs> for a bit. Yeah, yeah. It's just like coming. Would actually, be fun. <laughs> just come and beat me if you want. Meet me. Oh, my pants gone. <laughs> uh, yep, yep. Because you know, in the Kim Possible intro, Ron would lose his pants every time in the injury. It's just like, phew, oh crap. Where's my pants? Yep. You would have pants such bad clear. luck. <laughs> oh man, that was the good shit. <laughs> I got off track a little. Days. I got off track a little on that. Uh, question ten: What is your favorite thing to do in VR chat? Well, as I described it before, I like to hang out with friends. Huggies. <laughs> I just love being with friends, giving huggies, watching movies, having fun, just being with friends. Yeah. Hold on, what the f- Oh, that's my PC making that jet sound, what the shit? <laughs> uh, it doesn't help when having an Alienware tower, you just hear it go Because, <laughs> like, I have- uh, I, yeah, I get that. Uh, I have upgraded that thing so much with its RAM and whatever else, I'm like, Jesus Christ, I'm throttling the crap out of this thing. <laughs> Uh, Maybe time to just get a fully new one. <laughs> well, I bought off my dad for only $100, so it's uh, not bad. Mm, no. Because the only last upgrade I would do if I wanted to, because, you know, I mentioned it on here, I would probably just get a 3090 graphics card and be fine for a while. Uh, mm-hmm. Okay, question 11. What is your favorite anime? My favorite anime. Mm, I don't really know. <laughs> it's hard to pick a favorite one. Um, <laughs> I guess with I cannot really pick one. So mm. I'm just gonna give you like maybe the top three or something. The ones I really liked lately were uh, uh, Dr. Stone, I really loved. Tokyo Revengers, I really loved. And then just any Ghibli movie. <laughs> I just love them. <laughs> oh, no, that's understandable. This with me is a different story than whatever else I like doing. Because I like Dragon Ball and... Uh, what else? Oh, and Dragon Ball? And what was that one anime where... This one person with a, another dragon is hunting down dragon species. I forgot about the name, but it's really good. Mm. I would probably have to check my one anime listing up where I watch, where I keep, you know, a list of anime where I watch. I can probably show you oh. it later and sh- show you the name because it's really good. Yeah. Because this dude literally. Yeah, share it with me. Can have a look. Because in the anime, this dude literally, <laughs> ha- like, because. Silver, like crystals or whatever they are, can kill the dragons. Mm-hmm. And this future mm-hmm. version of himself, like, uh, puts that kind of sword magic or whatever into his 
younger's past self body, and then he gets powers that literally could just one shot the dragons and kill them. Oh, so basically he becomes really fucking fun. strong, and it's not bad. <laughs> Is one of the episodes uh-huh. like he almost killed like the final boss like early. I'm like, oh my god, he annihilated her almost. <laughs> but anyways, <laughs> um, I don't know what else to say on that one. Uh, last question: If you could go back in time when you first joined VR Chat, what would you do differently? What would I do differently? Hmm. I guess what I would do differently is one, I would start talking because I was a mute for years. <laughs> um, and just talk more with people with my friend group that that's fallen apart, back together and just hang out again. <laughs> Be close with my friends. One more. That's the only thing I would do. <laughs> I hit too hard like it, it shouldn't have. God damn. <laughs> and actually, you know what? To end this off in a positive note. Hero, come on. Get over here, bud. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyways. <laughs> uh, you know what? Uh, I think that's all the questions I have. But uh, thanks for coming on. And, um... Mm-hmm. If, yeah, of course. If you ever want to come back, just let me know. I would be fine hitting you up again for season two or yeah, well. Just ask me if you want. Yeah, well, actually, I'll be happy to, to to come back. Yeah, and actually, um, if season two gets fold up, uh, gets fold out of nowhere, uh, and season two does fine, uh, I could put you on season three, just in case, if we haven't. Yeah, sure. Yeah, but anyways, uh, besides that. Thank you guys for coming out to What the Fox Season 1, uh, Episode 1 re-uploaded with Blood Wolf. And with that, we're going to end this one for now, and I will see you guys next time. Hold on, let me, let me do this. And uh, Blood, do your signature sing lang, mm-hmm. but you like to say what you like to give people, if you want to. Oh, <laughs>